Dry shampoo isn't working. Come on, dry shampoo, work. I need volume. I'm going somewhere important and I just need volume. Please give me volume. Maybe I can make this. Let's see, what will I need? Hmm. Hey guys, it's Kelly and I'm in the kitchen because I decided I want to do DIY dry shampoo. I'm not sure why. <laughs> I'm not sure why I decided to do this. I just wanted to. And unfortunately, nothing exists on the internet about using dry shampoo without having something expensive like white powder or something. So I got all scientific and crafted it with cornstarch and baking soda. And it was super easy and my hair is like really volumized. Like I just, I was like out of the shower now and I just dried my hair. So it's not that volumized right now because I did not shower before this video. I showered, the, I showered yesterday, but today I did not shower yet. So until like right now, because I just wanted to show you guys that it was like true that it actually works and it is so amazing it is like so great how fast this works it's a little hard like rubbing in but is any dry shampoo not hard to like get in and it is just so amazing how fast this works and if you try this out make sure to hashtag on twitter or instagram it to kelly gal dry shampoo and yeah so let go with the video so you're gonna need cornstarch and baking soda You want to add two thirds cornstarch and one third baking soda so just put it all in and you can put it into a bowl and then change it into like a baby food a baby powder bottle or a salt shaker anytime you want either mix it or shake it up then to apply it you can either use a baby powder bottle or like any shaker bottle you can even use like a salt bottle or you can and like just pour it in and apply it or you can just apply it from the bowl. So I'm going to apply it from the bowl. Whoa, that really got my hair up there. Now I'm going to add some more. So this side is the dry shampoo and this side is the DIY dry shampoo. Let's see which one's better. So I found that they go on the exact same, except for almost like you use the bowl and the spoon. They go on the same and they rub out the same. They go on the same and they blend out the same. Now I'm gonna go hang out with friends. Let's see what I look like when I come back. I look great. But let's see how I dry shampoo looks. This one is still on like all the way. This one is still on like all the Except way. Except for once again. A lot of money and handmade. And you may be wondering why cornstarch and baking soda. Well, it helps deodorize and helps retain volume and it's white. So you, so it's, it's the exact same thing as dry shampoo, except for it's way less expensive. And it also smells like really good. Oh, it smells like cake mix. If you try this out, make sure to hashtag Kelly Gal Dry Shampoo. I will click that like button on either Twitter or Instagram. Make sure to do that. Cause I wanna see if you guys do it.